Hoop City. Shout out to Hoop City. I ain't never been in the back seat, so. I'm the real deal. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm the real deal when I go. Alright, yeah, you did a good job though. You ain't here. Oh my god. Wait till we come from Farmington, we hit that freeway. Whatever. Y'all don't want to see no problem. Give me my uh, keys, dog. I don't want no problems. <laughs> hey, yo, this green van, get up. Dog. So if y'all want to race, let All me know. we be in the back seat. Oh. oh my god. What bag? What bag? Here, big fella. Robert Davis Jr., class of 2022, I go to Farmington High School. This summer and uh, work with him. You know, he's a junior in high school now. You know, he's 6'5, six, 6'6 six, six now. Um, skills, his body's coming together. So um, he's just a great kid, man. Super hard work every time he, every time he comes in. He's a leader um, on the court. Um, good energy. Um, just goes hard. You know, just goes really hard. So um, just a great kid. And I think he has a chance to be really special in the future at a high level, you know, and um, down the road making some money with this game, too. types of stuff. Uh, it was in the city, though. Uh, we was playing, playing against my boy Cash, RP Cash. Uh, we won the championship there. Good little, good little championship. What's this? I don't even know where this is from. This 
It don't even got no name on it, nothing, but it got some basketball shoes on there, so. Uh, this is actually my mom's right here from Barcelona. Uh, this was in 2001 when she was overseas. Gotta keep that in here because, you know, she don't want her medals, so I have to take them. This one right here, 2015. Well, what grade was I in 2015? It was middle school. This is probably when I was playing with One Nation. Midwest Athletic Championship, most definitely. Won a lot of those. Here's another one, but this one's second place. Ew. We don't like those in second place. Uh, I think this one was Midwest, too. That one was Midwest. And then this one is my mom's from overseas, too. And, oh, shit. We got this one from Midwest. Tell me, we won a lot of those championships, like, all playing at Harper Woods, too. This one is also from Barcelona. Then you got these right here. These are from uh, Midwest and I think May. Midwest and May, both of these. And then this one was uh, when I was playing with Reach. And we played at the uh, Adidas Gauntlet. And we won the bronze championship. I've been winning all my life. Winning is... Winning is what's most important to me. Honestly, I win in everything. If I don't win, I'm gonna be mad, no matter what it is. Who know? We can be playing rock, paper, scissors, hooping. If I don't win, I'm gonna be mad. And I'm gonna win the next one, most definitely. And if I don't, I'm gonna win the next one after that. We gonna keep playing till I win. Uh, We gonna start with these. Uh, I used to not wear Jordans, actually. I did. I really used to never wear Jordans. I never had a pair of Jordans in my life. Cause it was just I was just being different, honestly. But these I just got these on Christmas. My girl got them for me. Uh, good muckle ones, you know. Uh, we gonna start off light. We gonna start off light. I got these from the Nike outlet, but this is back when it was like one sixty, one something. Not at like ninety dollars. Kind of mad about it because I paid too much for them. Actually, LJ got me these for my birthday. Uh, something like I wore these on my birthday to the game. Converse CDG joints right here. Everybody that follow me on Instagram seen these. Wore these a couple times. Tokyo Biohacks. You know what I'm saying? Pink laces in there. Usually got the pink laces in, but you know what I'm saying? Something. Hoop shoes. These are tough. These are tough. These are my first pair of KD13s right here. I don't even know what these is called. I'm not finna try to think of what they call. But... Actually, it might be in the box. Nah, oh, they call it the Citrus. I most recently caught these, just got these on my birthday, right here. I think it's called the Carbon. Oh, and then I got these. Before that, the Butters. You know, they're a little dirty right now. Put them in the washing machine later or something like that. Custom made, my own boy Tab. You know what I'm saying? The Neighborhood Shoe Man on Instagram. You know what I'm saying? Get at him. Uh, my boy Smoothie, Titus. Both of them passed away in 2019 and 2020. You know what I'm saying? Long live smoothie, most definitely. Long live Titus. Now on the back, you know what I'm saying? I got RP Kobe on the back. RP GG 824. And I got Long Live KK. You know what I'm saying? RP Casey. You feel me? Every, I think every sneakerhead got a pair of 97s in the closet. All right? They look dirty though. Some more hoop shoes. KD. These, these. The flower joints. But I'm not going to lie to you. I was the first one in Michigan had these. I got them in Atlanta. I got them in Atlanta. I posted them. Came back. And like two days went by. Went to first game. Somebody had them on. It just stood in my drip. You know what I'm saying? You post something, everybody wanted. Speedy gave me these. Black and red ones. Never worn. Never worn. I might wear these ones. I don't even know when I'm going to wear these. Oh. These is these are my running shoes. They they went from hooping shoes to running shoes. Honestly, these these ran through. I wear these when I when I run too most definitely. And here we got I can do all the things. You know what I'm saying? Cause you never doubt yourself. And you got RPG, my recipes, my grandma right there, Kobe, GG, grandma, smoothie right here, Titus over here. I gotta make a tribute always on all my shoes. Everybody that's on them shoes did a lot for me, honestly. Now, I think I wore these like cool four, five times. Like, 
Little Kyrie right here with a little tiger print on them. These, these is tough. These is tough. I'm say the rest. I'm say, trying to save them for the season, but they're so icy. Chauncey put me on, to be honest. Uh, Chauncey, he got the uh, he got the all pink ones, and I was like, damn, I want them. So I just got these right here, blue and pink ones. Wore these in a couple games last season. Who you know got a shoe closet, and they gonna show the dress shoes. The tour joints. I just wore these recently, actually. Peep the Instagram. These white ones, they low key dirty because I've been worn them a whole bunch of times, but they didn't come with these laces. I just improvised, you know what I'm saying? I wore these a lot. This is the college envelope no, mailbox or whatever. It's a lot of mail in here, posters, all types of stuff, you know what I'm saying? Fashion is, is up there, you know what I'm saying? You got hooping and everything else, then you got modeling right there, you know what I'm saying? Went to Atlanta for modeling a couple times. Uh, also did a couple shoots with some clothes or whatever. There's a lot of brands that be hitting me up, but I be scared. I don't, I don't be knowing if they gonna pay me or not, but you know what I'm saying? It's worth a shot, but you know what I'm saying? Fashion is most definitely really, really, really like that with me. You know what I'm saying? You see what I got on. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Who, who, who wearing a turtleneck with a jean jacket? Nobody, you feel me? Hey, mom. Hi. How you going? Do you want some salmon? Huh? You want no. Some, you just smoke the bacon, eggs, and the pan. Yes. Yeah, all right. You say that. She don't really cook like that. She lied. Like, just like one time thing. The camera came. She wanted to cook breakfast and all of that. Because realize it's 2 p.m. And she just not cooking breakfast. Said something right there. Me and my mom are best friends, most definitely. Uh, we could tell each other anything, literally talk every day there's not a day i don't go without talking to her even if i'm not even with her she'll call me i'll call her honestly it's really the best relationship i have and it's i'm really grateful for it because not everybody can have that relationship not even with just their mom with any parent or anybody it's gonna be about an hour and a half came here grabbing two fish you know what i'm saying one black one red that's the first one is black, you know what I'm saying? I put Casey on it, represent my sister Casey. Then the red one, uh, you know what I'm saying? They got the Detroit logo on it, rep my city, you feel me? Put Wang on it, that's me and my brothers, you know what I'm saying? That's a little group. That's crazy, you that's oh, yeah. No, what? I'll where, give you money back. Where's your money? Huh? Where's your money? I want to know, what if I had no money to buy anything right now? What would you do? That's crazy, dog. Like, that's, I don't even like having kids sometimes because I told you specifically that we was coming to exchange. Look, bro, you want me to buy it or not? You got some, that means you got some money. You got, <laughs> I ain't got no money. <laughs> Where, <laughs> what you talking about? Wait, let me see. 200. I can check your bank account. Ain't nothing in my bank account. So, we, where the cash at? I ain't got no money. Let me see. Oh, he go to Wiley, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got your own hands. You got it here. Although I'm his mother, a lot of people would probably say that we are more like friends. Um, our relationship is, is a friendship. Um, I, I do the mothership for sure, but I've always thought about having kids, and I didn't want my kids to be afraid to tell me anything or talk to me. So I built our relationship off of love, um, discipline, and just um, goals, a bunch of goals. So I've always set goals for him or had him set goals for himself as he got older. And through that, we have this friendship relationship. I call it, it's a love and hate sometimes because I push him to the max. But the one thing I love about Robert is that he likes to perform at the max. So um, I was just telling somebody earlier, you know, I and mean, then he's shooting and he's practicing and working on shooting. He'll make a lot of shots and he'll miss a lot of shots because he gets upset. But when he's in the game. He makes shots at the end of the day. Like it's a totally different thing. And um, you got to be great um, to be able to actually make shots under pressure and, and, and play under pressure.